What's up dudes? Uh, so tonight I decided to read a scary story called Knock Knock Horang? 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 I don't know. Um, I guess we'll just go for it. The following is a special chiller thriller which may include shocking scenes, severe discussion and advice for pregnant women, the elderly, and those with weak hearts. Right, and my volume is pretty high. Alright. Tap, tap. Tap, 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 tap. Oh gosh. Ninji. Ah, mom! <laughs> what are you still doing up? I have to finish this report by tomorrow. Uh... You're such a hard worker. Have some of these while you do your report. Wow, thanks, Mom. Hmm, your cookies are the best. Is Dad still not home? Ah, uh, your dad went on a business trip today. He'll be back in a couple of days. Ah! This happened in the summer of 2013. Take care. Oh gosh, why is it glitching around? At around 1 a.m. I was heading to the nearby Seoul station since I was having a hard time finding out finding any customers around this residential area. Oh hey, it's her. Sir, would you mind opening the trunk for me? Oh, I'll put your bag in for you. I put her suitcase in the trunk and returned to the driver's seat. Where should I take you? Oh, I'm going to 180 16 Munjong Dong. Munjong Dong 180 1. Did you just get back from a trip? I just got back from Japan. I was studying there. Ah, how long were you there for? Uh, around five months. I was studying art. I decided to go for a little stay since I'm on holiday. The girl seemed like the type who enjoyed chatting. Ah, so are you going to get a job there? The economy is terribly here. I like talking with customers, so I started making conversation with her. It's hard to get a job anywhere in the arts. I just wanted to get home and see my dad. You only miss your dad? That must make your, son, your mom sad. How all my stepmom cares about his money anyway. I felt like I had touched on a sensitive issue, so I quickly changed topics. Ah, there's Oksu Station over there. Have you heard that story about the ghost at Oksu Station? Of course I have. Everyone's been passing it around online. Ah, I thought you might not have heard since you were in Japan. They have internet in Japan too. You know, besides that whole story is made up. It wasn't even scary. That author is always trying to come up with stuff to scare people. Isn't that what horror is all about? Oh wait, isn't, uh, isn't that what horror is all about? Well, in my neighborhood, there's this game that was really popular. Have you heard of the Walnut Ghost? A what ghost? Walnut Ghost? Walnut Ghost. It's this game where you summon a ghost and ask it stuff. I tried it with my friends when I was little and it really worked. So it's like fortune telling. Uh, the game is simple in a classroom or some kind of room. You go around knocking on the wall until you've made a complete circle of the room. Ow, ow, I did on my knuckles. As you go around knocking the wall, you'll find a place in the wall that's empty and that goes thud when you hit it. Uh, that's where there's a trapped spirit. Aha. 
If you stand in front of that spot with your friend and ask a question as you hold a pencil up to the wall and then drop it, the pencil will fall and face either you or your friend. For example, if you ask something like, oh spirit within the wall, who among us will get a boyfriend first? They will point to whoever will find a guy first. Oh wow, so who did it say would find a guy first? Me, and it actually worked out like that, but we broke up pretty soon after. Ha ha! <laughs> At first we just asked it silly questions like that, but then we suddenly started getting scared, so we started asking a question about life and death. Like, which of us will die first? Who will die first? <laughs> Once again, it was me. Man, this actually is kind of scary. So does this wall not ghost only tell you who it is? It doesn't give you any details? For more detail, then you write down some answers to the questions you want to ask on a piece of paper on, and then leave it on the floor. The question at the time was, Ah, oh, right, how will I die? We wrote things like disease, accident, natural death as questions. Ah, since I'm with you in the car right now, I really hope the answer wasn't a car accident. Ha ha ha, it wasn't. And then suddenly, it was all quiet in the car. After sitting in silence for about a minute, I broke the crushing silence. So, what did it say? Oh, jeez, so creepy, huh? <laughs> oh, look, we're already here. You live in one of those buildings, right? Miss? Oh, gosh. Oh, Nani? The girl who had been sitting in the back seat wasn't there. Surprisingly, her suitcase was still in the trunk. Filled with fear, I took her suitcase out of the trunk. I opened it as if urged on by some unseen force. Oh shoot, it's moving. Uh, uh, close it back up. Oh! 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 <laughs> okay. Oh. When I saw the body of the girl who had been sitting in the back seat, I immediately called the police and they soon arrived. I explained to them how I had ended up here with a suitcase containing a dead body. Surprising enough. This was her house. The investigation began as the police attempted to keep her sobbing mother back who had seen the corpse. Around five months earlier, her mother has reported her daughter missing. On the security camera uh, near the shopping mall where she had gotten in the taxi, all that was shown was me lifting a suitcase off the sidewalk and putting it in the trunk. Her voice was not recorded on the taxi's black box either. It was just a recording of me talking to myself. The security camera footage showed the man who had dropped the suitcase off there. But the resolution was too slow or low to determine his identity. Who could he be? The murderer? Who 
Who killed her? Or perhaps just someone else in the same position as me. But one thing is certain. Even after she was dead, she really wanted to return home. Around a month had gone by after that. I was eating some cookies which her mother had given me to thank me for returning her daughter to her. Mmm, these are good. Are they still not found a murder? When they suddenly, I remember the game which she told me about. The wall knock ghost. Knock, 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 knock. Wait, oh wait. Third. Found it. Wall knock ghost. Is the man on the security camera footage the one who killed that girl? Yes. Roll, huh? Cookies? The end. Oh gosh. Like my reaction. <laughs> All right, well, that was a was a great story. Uh, I want to go cry now. Thanks, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.